Let's get salty! Everyone, Zeddy here again today with a brand new video, and we are a couple of weeks removed from the latest mini set. We've seen some balance changes. We've seen the new twist mode that has had an interesting start. We've seen a lot of things. And unlike other years where you expect that expansion announcement to come sometime in July, I believe we are getting that expansion announcement sooner than we've ever had it. And I'm pretty sure I think I know the day. So we're gonna go into all of that, what the expansion might entail. We'd we'll be getting Monk. I like, really, are we, are we gonna say that every expansion till it happens? Probably. Well, we're gonna go through all the clues and all the evidence as to why, yeah, I think we're getting a dispatch announcement soon. And again, what that could all mean. And if you enjoy the content on the channel, feel like I've earned your subscription, please hit that sub button down below, give the video a like, it helps out a lot as we're on the road to 83,000 subscribers. And of course, when we get that expansion announcement, we'll have a giveaway. We'll be giving away mega bundles, regular pre-orders out of my pocket. So you'll wanna be sub for that too. So. Be ready for that. I'm gonna be trying to make myself go broke again. It never seems to happen. I don't know why. It's almost like it's complete semantics. Regardless, let's take a look at the whole uh, spiel of what I'm talking about. And that is the expansion announcement likely coming soon. So this banner was put into the year of the Pegasus um, like preview. And they had a preview image of all three expansions coming up. Obviously we got Whizbang's workshop here. We got the toys or the like the little gears and the, the plushies. The middle is the one we are expecting to be the next expansion announcement. Kind of like a beach theme, a lot of people are thinking, right? You got the you got the leaf and you got the, the tree, you got the beach, you know, sand and the water and rocks. And then we have, we'll maybe speculate on that four months from now, like some wintry style theme. Or we're getting a frozen based Disney expansion. I, I kind of doubt that, but uh, yeah, beach theme which has a lot of people already like speculating pandaria monks and all of that but why do i think it's going to come soon it's only early june well with bang's workshop uh came out er a month earlier than normal as did the last expansion it's on a month earlier cycle now and i think that's going to stay consistent and we just had patch 20 or 29.4 right point four and what always follows that about a month later or so is the point six patch which has always a battleground shakeup but more importantly as you can see here the expansion pre-order which hopefully will not have early access cards and there's also uh usually well actually we got the free gifts this time and store a uh, hearthstone brew and Calerio, the uh, artist, or Cliffro, the artist, which didn't do so well, isn't that great? But I'm curious if they're gonna have like a, a 10 year anniversary thing for like every set. Maybe they could just do something fun. I know another course set edition or uh, event edition, right? We could see that maybe a return to a classic card or who knows what. But the other thing is we'll probably get an event with it, right? There's usually an event. And well, if you take a look in the Hearthstone client itself, this event ends on June 11th. And that's the day I think we will get an expansion announcement on a Tuesday. It's usually a patch day, Tuesday or Thursday. And yes, I do think that is the day that will happen because typically they'll announce an expansion and just over a month later it'll come out. And I have a pretty good reason onto the day of the expansion, I think will come out too. And just over a month after this, <laughs> this event will end and the 11th happens, well, hey, July 23rd, the Whizbangs Workshop Tavern Pass expires. And if we take a look at our trusty calendar here, what day is that? Well, it just happens to be a Tuesday. It could, could come out on a Thursday, but yeah, I'm thinking this is the week we get the expansion. I think the last two or three expansions have perfectly lined up for when the Tavern Pass is no longer offered to be bought. And um, this one actually just changed, like just changed. I tweeted like a little bit ago uh, that to be a week later than before. So all the sides point to yes the expansion coming out mid-july mid to later july and the announcement likely coming next week and what can we expect from it are we gonna get monk we had a whole deep dive like twitter thread by ibic based on one battlegrounds screenshot that we're gonna get monk i don't think we're gonna get new class i don't think you're gonna add it two sets in um that would be it was already awkward enough three sets in i don't think something like that that is happening but i think a good sign of things to look at for clues besides you know it's just a beach and it could be completely whatever is the mini set cards a lot of times they add little pieces in to a mini set that make a lot more sense later like a key example for me is like overgrown beanstalk um a treant card right there's so little train support in standard right now. And this is a really powerful card. The summon a 2-2 treant, draw a card for each treant you control. 
You can draw seven cards of this bad boy, right? And by itself, it's still a three mana two two draw card. That's okay. But regardless, um, there's just not a lot of train support. It feels like it kind of comes out of nowhere. I don't know if that's like same argument for like Warrior just randomly got a bomb card when there's like no other bomb cards in standard except for like one neutral in the mini set, right? It, it's kind of peculiar. So you can look through and look at the cards that I don't know, maybe uh, an Evolve Shaman style deck could pop up or... I think about beaches in general, uh, Murlocs. Murlocs and like pirates. I want like a throwback to Goblins versus Gnomes in the second expansion ever. Let's have Murlocs versus pirates. The reason I say that, like Rogue in particular, got a decent little pirate set, but they're missing so many pirates. Can you imagine they gave like a bunch of actual good pirates to make Pirate Rogue a thing? You look at Shaman, they just got a Murloc, although it's just really good on its own, but I don't know, I think that'd be such a sweet little throwback. Murlocs versus pirates or something silly like that. And may, I, I don't know how you make a beach theme not silly and fun, but and yeah, it'll be interesting to see if they add anything to like this event tab, right? Like this, this is a 10 year anniversary. They're saying they're, they're gonna celebrate it the entire year. They could add whatever here. They could add like, cards from the past as like additional core set cards they can do whatever they want they can add more gifts they should just add golden hearthstone brew for everybody instead of that stupid paywall when i have the diamond why would i use the gold i know it's a whole different argument but still really silly and before i have to read a million questions about it in chat when the the rewards track if they do announce this next expansion like a week or so the rewards track will remain until the next expansion comes in and is live so you don't have to worry about that but you might want to start thinking about trying to get your way to level 100 and start working your way through that and the one cool thing that will be uh, present for the next set is uh normally i have to be like okay guys if you're looking at achievements and stuff you might want to work ahead of time get them done uh now you don't have to the xp will stay so that's also another thing i get asked a lot about because yeah they changed it now that there's less achievements but the xp will stick around and you can see even i've been lazy i haven't completed the ball and no i'm not doing a guide on it because they downscaled it and it's just you want to ask how to complete an achievement just come to my stream ask me i could give you some tips but overall yeah we'll see if uh i'm correct the next expansion coming in like a week or like on next tuesday we'll have to wait and see but let me know in the comments down below what you think that beach theme could mean what kind of cards would you like to see or maybe what returning classic favorite style of cards would you like seeing added to the game because i have a feeling it's going to be more than just a simple expansion because hey it's the 10 year anniversary and it's been such a success so far. Weekly quest controversy, twist launch being horrible down seasons, people being mad over the actual event and the gifts. And um, yeah, there's been a lot of bad stuff, but hey, it can only go up from here, right? Oh yeah, I don't know about that. Anyways, let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. And if you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe. Have a great day and stay salty, my friends.